morning, everybody. Welcome back to Subnautica. Uh, if you didn't watch the, um, the little mini video I put out yesterday, uh, basically what happened is uh, I was a doofus and I forgot to um, I forgot to uh, turn my mic back on. So I recorded like three and a half hours of footage with nothing going on in it, basically. So <clears throat> what's happened since you guys were gone? I did some more off-camera work because, you know, reasons. So we now have a scanner room, which is, you know, pretty decent. It's, uh, you know, our, our base is already screwy, so we may as well just, you know, add on to that. Got some bulkheads for some extra support. Found the interior grow bed as well as the blueprint for the propulsion cannon. So we can actually go to the Aurora now. Uh, we also found a battery charger thing, which would be very helpful because I tend to go through batteries like it's water. Same thing, more or less, with the sea moth. I haven't really done much with it. It's, you know, it is what it is. It's, it's, it's it works. <laughs> we keep getting it bashed in by, you know, sand sharks and stuff, and I can't repair this up here, can I? Dark. All right, but yeah, that that's where we're at. So uh, in today's episode, we're gonna prepare a little bit. We're gonna get some food and some water, and then we're gonna go ahead and we're actually going to go and visit the Aurora this time. Instead of just kind of, you know, bumbling around hoping that we have, uh, you know, a way in. Um, just want to make sure that I am set before I go. Because, yeah, I do have hay water, but I'll make sure I have some food. Um, yeah, I might as well just go out and look. <clears throat> Oh, uh, I also ran into the blood kelp zone real quick, uh, which is, you know, I figured that'd be easier than while I was searching for the propulsion cannon because the internet told me, <laughs> I googled it because I was like, okay, I'm not going to spend another four hours, you know, looking for this stupid piece. It was like, oh, yeah, uh, the pieces are in the, the uh, floating island zone, and I'm like, oh, okay. That sounds really late game for the propulsion cannon, but sure, I'll trust Google. Then I trusted Google. And, uh, I shouldn't have trusted Google. Uh, actually, honestly, just one should be plenty, right? I mean, I don't have to spend a ton of time in the Aurora. Mr. Mr. Boomerang, you can you can go free. Alright. Welcome to water and some food. That should be plenty. I have a first aid kit. Uh, I have okay, I have my let or my <coughs> radiation helmet on. I have a fire extinguisher, we should probably put that on three. Um actually before we go crazy here, I want I want a battery. My repair tool is almost out, and I know that won't be enough for. I know that won't be enough for. Um, uh, ta 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 ta! What am I thinking of? Guys, help me! It won't be enough for the reactor. That's what I'm thinking. Alright. Battery, please. Oh, I forgot to start my timer. I keep doing that. Oh my gosh. Uh, I'm short copper. Let's just get some more copper. Let's make a couple batteries. Yeah, let's make a couple batteries. And that way we can. Ooh, hello, excuse me, sorry. I apparently accidentally put that on my one slot. That's okay. Um. I gotta fix this now. Two, three, four. Yeah, that works for now. Uh, yeah. Alright, and then we'll just carry the other ones, I guess, in our pocket for now, because everything else is pretty good. Ah, the scanner. <clears throat> That'll be good. That'll 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 last us for a minute. And these are still working on growing, so that's good. Alright. Now for real this time, let's let's get going to the Aurora. 
just have a feeling. Got some parallels as soon as it gets out. Closer to the Aurora, anyway. At a better angle to get there without dealing with the Reaper. You guys didn't miss any Reaper attacks, by the way. I was fine. I was fine. There was there was no Reaper issues. We heard him. He just didn't, you know. He didn't show up. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> Oh my gosh. It was stop. <laughs> it's not fair. See, I had a radio message last time, but it didn't it didn't give it to me, so I don't know what that's about. I must have just missed it. Alright. We are headed to the Aurora. Go this way. Alright. As soon as we get this fixed, that'll help us with the radiation. Because the radiation should go away from the world. And that would be very helpful. Is that... Can anyone else see, just see the peeper that was just like T-posing? Okay. Wait, I'm still going the right way, right? Yes. But yeah, no, Google was like, okay, so you're looking for wrecks at the crash zone or in the floating aisle zone. I'm like, okay, well, the only wreck I know in the floating aisle zone is the one that's, like, suspended. So I went there, almost lost Seamuth, and then, like, I- it was just- it was pointless. It was pretty much pointless. That's a stalker and a sand shark fighting. Ooh, I am voting for the stalker. Very unexciting and very frustrating anyway, so you guys didn't miss much. I will admit it was kind of funny that I was very lost, even though all I had to do was go back to the pod and then kind of triangulate my location back towards where base was. And then I found a beacon out of frustration and, and you know, out of frustration made a made a beacon. Let's just slip through here so I don't have to worry about the river. And before I hear it coming. Alright. Thank you for putting me behind it this time. Alright. Uh, let's put that on five. I killed quite a few of these guys the last time I was here. But, last, it seems as though they respawn. I love how it just eats creatures. Um, I will take this just in case because I do have like 60% on this. Data. Oh, I actually do need that, don't I? Uh, 6483. <clears throat> New 
blueprint acquired. Data bank corruption was detected on your PDA. Your technology blueprints have been updated. Laser cutter time. Uh, put that on fork now. Come on. This is the prawn soup. I only had one piece. Ah. Well then. Alright, uh. Use the last. Oh, nope, never mind. Okay. PDA data. I want to be really thorough coming through here because if I remember right, PDA data. this is where the bobble heads are, aren't they? Or are they somewhere else? If I can't have YouTuber merch in real life, I can at least have YouTuber merch in video games. <laughs> uh, room Scans of damage to the Aurora do not match any known offensive technologies. Well, yeah. 
It's almost like we're on an alien planet. Aliens used to live here. Hello? Oh, 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 the leeches. The leeches, the leeches, the leeches. Oh crap, they're here. Alright. Well, Seamoth Bay is boned, isn't it? It's like in the. It's in the ocean. We already went there. There shouldn't be anything here. Ooh, another depth module upgrade. Shiny. Not like it's gonna do anything, but oh, it's just a different scene that way. Integrate new PDA data. During collision, do not attempt repair without appropriate qualifications. Why am I still swearing but not swimming? Friend, you are on land now. Walk, please. Yeah. If I remember right, there are bleeders in here too. Containment breach repaired. Further breaches detected. Containment breach repaired. Further breaches detected. Oh, yep. Back off, bruh. Containment breach repaired. Further breaches detected. Come on. Oh boy. <laughs> Underwater, you know, in the radioactive zone. It's fine. It's a video game. Containment breach repaired. Nothing works Further the way it should. Containment breach repaired. Uh, I saw sparks up. No, it's not. Why didn't I just hear splash? <coughs> That's alarming. Containment breach repaired. Okay. Further breaches detected. Do you think the containment others repaired. the bases on the other Further side of the planet from detected. Zero know about this? That's the question. I guess I haven't seen enough people play Zero. I instinctively switch to four because that's usually where I have my sea glide. Drive core breach sealed. Radiation levels decreasing. Okay. 
Excellent. There we are. Alright, now we need... Oh, yay. Uh... Now we need to find the captain's quarters. <clears throat> Get the rocket with them. somewhere. I don't think this goes there, right? Yeah, no way. Alright. Alright, I came- I broke through there. That was the warp core. The warp core! The, yes, upstairs the prod bay. Is there a way up there safe? Kind of. Um, excuse me. Oh, wait. How in oblivion are you supposed to reach those? Or are you just supposed to look at them and think they look pretty? That only takes up one space. I was like, Integrate new PDA data. There. The shelves. Anything else in here? I think I already have a vending machine blueprint. That was the extra fire extinguisher. Alright, let's go in here. If I do... if I can bag is empty cannot pick up but I just put stuff in there bag is oh bag is not empty okay there's really no point in those then uh this is probably the captain's cabin. Well, oh, that's the captain's quarters. Uh, let's check a couple of these. Alright, um... Apsro! No. 
definitely in here. Hold on, wait. Was it six eight four two? No, cause that was that's too close to the other one, ain't it? Degasi. It's all Degasi. Oh my gosh. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. It would be in here. Not in there, that's for sure. Not in there, that's for sure. Wait, hold on. It, it'd be in here. It'd be in here? It'd be in here. Uh, where are you, Absaro? That's all the way at the beginning. Absaro, where are you? Okay, there it is. Uh, Altair HQ. Two six seven nine. Thanks, Absor. Yes, Ganon. I know. Oh man. Integrating new PDA data. Inventory full my left butt. Uh -oh. Gosh, I don't need to eat. That's locked. What was the code on this one? Did we get the code on this one? I don't think we did. Hmm. 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 Average long range transmission delay, eight hours. Yeah, Opening that's... last recorded transmissions. This is an emergency distress call. Aurora is on collision course with planet 4546B. Sending all available environmental data. Please respond with rescue solution out. This is Altera HQ. Attached to this message, you should find the blueprints for an escape ship that we calculate hey, will be capable of breaking orbit and getting you back to the nearest phase gate. Now, it's designed to use materials you can find and sit you, but it's gonna need one hell of a power source. Now, we'll be sure to... Aurora Long Range Communications Relay. Offline. <laughs> Integrating new PDA data. <clears throat> Ooh. Excuse you. Huh? Integrating new PDA data. Huh? Huh? First aid kits. I guess I could use the one I have. Battery. Yes, please. Huh? Huh? Let me just draw. You know, jump into the fire. That yeah, the brilliant rain. This is empty. Pick up the battery. Alright. Huh? block. I feel like I'm cool. See, this is the thing. You get all prepped to go to the Aurora, and then the Aurora is like, oh yeah, here, have some extra food. This is like going to Grandma's house. Do you want a cookie? No, oh, Grandma, thank you. I already ate. I think you should have a cookie. I, I thank you, Grandma, but I don't want a cookie. I think you should have a cookie. Oh, thank you, Grandma. I will have a cookie. All right, that is what I needed from here. I think I got all the toys and stuff. I think, if I remember right, uh, I. If, if I'm remembering right at all, I think Sam um, is with one of the cuttlefish. I don't remember where Mark is. Uh, this is not the right way. Wait, this is. I gotta go up. Okay, 
we have my phone turned off. That does not bode well, guys. That means I've been at this long enough. Oh no, we're almost, we're almost, we're almost done. We're almost there. Uh, I skirt around here, right? Yep, okay. Almost free. Seamooth is very close. Alright, get our knife out. Okay. Okay. Freedom! And I missed a Reaper. I know you're out over yonder somewhere. Welcome aboard, Captain. Would very much appreciate it if you did not bother. Thank you. Actually, honestly, if the Reaper hits me once, I should be fine. I'm almost at full health. And I think it only takes, like, 60%. But I don't really want to test it out. We'll just- we'll just get home safe and call it an episode, okay? <laughs> Ooh, there's Bronzo Titanium out here. Cool. Oh, I can put- uh... That's the wrong button. Sorry, I've been playing Minecraft lately. I can put that back on. Oh, no, I can't. I could have sworn that it was uh, once you once you did the uh, the thing. The thing with the thing. Once you repaired the, the reactor, it was like, oh, yeah, you, you could do whatever you want now. But clearly, I was mistaken. See, last time I thought this red kelp zone, or this uh, grassy plains area, was my grassy plains area. And I ended up wandering around in this area for like, an hour. <laughs> it was good though, found some wrecks. Got some stuff. What is that a part of? Is that a bioreactor part? I already got that. That looks like a bioreactor. Here's my question, right? If we have this- Sorry. If we- if we have this huge nuclear reactor in our ship, right? Why do we need a, a, like, several dozen bioreactors on board as well? Just to process stuff? What happens with the extra power? What are the- what are the- what are the reasons for the- <laughs> Questioning the video game logic. Sorry. Go drop off some stuff, and in the next episode, guys, I guess we're making progress. <laughs> um, yeah, we did pretty good today, I think. Oh, my plants are growing too. Nice, awesome, sweet. All right, guys, in the next episode, we will we'll probably try and get down to that Gassy habitat down way below the island, way over, way over, way over, way over there, down there. That's probably our next goal, but we'll see how that goes. So, thanks for watching, everybody. I'll see you later. Bye!